Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a system image backup of Windows 10 to an external drive using the GUI. Now, just make sure that the hard drive is installed by going to this PC. I'll be backing up, in my case, to the external drive E, and it's a 40 gig hard drive. This drive is smaller than my uh, C drive, in this case, which is 50 gigs. All that matters is the space used on the C drive. So just right click properties. Notice that the space used here is 11.9 gigs. My external drive is 40. So we're good to go. I'll close all the windows here. Now head over to control panel. View by category, select small icons. file history and then on the bottom click on system image backup and now on the top left click on create system image now here is automatically selected the external drive E you can also back up to a DVD or a network location a network folder now if you have multiple external drives just click on the drop down to select the appropriate one and click on next. You'll be backing up the system reserved and the operating system drive C. Both of them are necessary. Click start backup to start creating the image backup. This can take a while depending on how much information you need to back up. You'll be prompted to create a repair disk. Now, this is good in the future if you're planning to recover from this image backup to use the repair disk. But right now, Windows 10 is free. I would recommend you to download Windows 10 in case you need to restore from this backup or reinstall Windows 10 in the future instead of creating the disk. It's all up to you. In my case, I'll select no and close. Exit out of here. And now to confirm the backup, go to this PC access your external drive and make sure you have the backup there Windows image backup perfect you can create as many image backup as you want to restore your PC from this backup you will need to boot from the Windows 10 disk or Windows 10 repair disk to do that you'll need to change the boot sequence in the BIOS I have all the necessary links in the description box below once you boot from that disk it'll say boot from CD or DVD press enter and here click on next repair your computer troubleshoot advanced options system image recovery Windows 10 now, it'll automatically select the last image backup you created. In this case, the location is external hard drive, D. It shows D because we booted off the disk. It changed the drive letter, but it is the external hard drive. Date and time and computer. If you created multiple images, you can click on select a system image to select a different image backup other than the last one created and click on next. Here, check mark format and repartition disks to replace all the information on that disk with the information on the image backup. You can also exclude disks if you want, install drivers in case you're having problems, or click advanced for more options. Click next and finish to confirm. Now, this pop up window is telling you that it'll replace all the information on the drive with the information on the system image backup. It'll take some time to create depending on how much information you need to restore. Once done, your computer will be restored back to the date you created that image backup. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.